today i'm going to show you how to make this disappear hello everyone welcome or welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be teaching you how to remove objects or remove things that you don't want in your video so when you're done filming and while you're editing you realize something is just off or there are some things you just don't want to see in your video and you're wondering how do i get rid of this i'm going to teach you how to get rid of the error or the objects in your background that you don't want people to see in this video we're going to be using two methods the first one is what i call the mask and move method and you can do this using any editing app of your choice as long as the app has as the masking tool now for this video we're going to be using the InShot editing tutorial because it's easy and fast and as usual on this channel the first step is to click on the like button and click on subscribe button if you want this tutorial to work for you if you don't it's not going to work and i don't know how to explain it it's kind of like a spiritual thing i don't know i don't know i don't know but just click on the like button okay and now let's get to it so now we go to our InShot app we go to videos we go to new we go to people overlay and then you overlay the same video and then you mask i recommend you pick the mask that is the same shape as the objects you have to move the mask to a point you would use to replace the picture you have to put it in a place that would look similar to the background um, I don't know how to use my words to explain it properly, but you can see what I'm doing. So I basically put the overlay overlay on the picture. Now, as you can see, the size I took was not enough to cover up the picture, so I had to do it again. Then you mask, you move the mask to the background. Yeah, you try and take the parts a blank part you would use to replace the picture make sure it's not close to any edge so that you don't have any dark line around it yeah that's done now you move the overlay to the picture part yeah so now as you can see there is a line around the edge so i just try to adjust that line pulling this little thing down don't pull it too hard because it will become transparent you can adjust the lighting because it looks a little bit darker than the background so just lighten it up a little bit to match with the background and we're done exactly now before i tell you the second method if you're still watching this video you obviously find it useful enough so why not click on subscribe button if you haven't i know i know you haven't click on the like button now okay now the second method you can use is what i like to call the magic removal method and with this method you have to use a photo editing app first before you edit on InShot using the mask tool and you have to use an app that has the magic remover or like a tool to remove an object automatically, usually an AI tool. So the first step is to take a screenshot of the video you want to edit. Then go into your photo editing app. We are going to be using Canva for this video and select the screenshot you just made. Then you go to effect. You go to magic eraser. You increase the brush size and you paint the part you want to remove and it automatically does it for you. Voila, it's done. So, so now you have to save the photo without making any further changes to it. Then you go to your InShot app. You go to video. You go to the video you want to edit. And then peep. That's PIP. Then you select the photo you just downloaded from Canva. Then you mask the photo. I initially chose this mask, but it's not flexible enough. 
So I decided to change the mask to a square size mask since the picture we want to remove is just a small square. And done. This method is way faster than the first method. For more simple but useful editing tutorials like this one, click on these videos here and I will see you in my next video.